hey, I'm excited about today's tip because this is a problem that I had for a couple of years and it was only through trial and error that I found the answer. Uh, most of the time when I have a virtual presentation uh, struggle, I can go to a video on YouTube and find an answer. As far as I know, this is the first video about this specific topic. But the challenge I had was that I would go into a slide presentation like you see here. I would come out of the screen share, maybe have some conversation, do a poll or ask a chat box question. And then when I went back to the presentation, it looked like this. I had the notes on the side, maybe the, the rest of my desktop background. It just didn't look good. And then I had to hit a button to get back into slide presentation mode. It wasn't smooth. It didn't look good. Well, I finally found the answer through trial and error. And here's how it works. Now, keep in mind, I use Apple products, but the concepts will work the same if you're on a PC. Now, I'm going to take you through a series of screenshots to walk you through this. It's actually very easy. It takes some repetition and practice to get comfortable with it, uh, but you'll get you'll become a pro pretty quickly. So you start by clicking on the green share button down at the bottom. And once you do that, you get an option of choices. For me, on Apple, I click the blue keynote box down here in the lower left. And once I click it, the box actually turns blue. That lets me know that's the one that's going to be shown. Now, you do not want to hit share yet. What you do is you then go to the tab, which will bring up your slide deck. For me, it's keynote again in Apple. That's not yet in slide presentation mode, as you can see here. That is the presentation, but see, I have all of my slides over to the left. I don't want to show that, and I, and I do not want to show this slide layout information. So at that point, I hit play. Now the slide deck is in slide presentation mode. At that point, I hit share. And now I'm in full presentation mode. I can go through a couple of slides. So at this point in the presentation, I want to come out of the talk. So I hit stop share down here at the bottom. Once I'm out of my slide presentation, I'm facing the camera, talking to the camera, asking my questions, having some conversation, whatever I'm doing. And then when I'm ready to go back into share mode, I click on the green share button again. I'm back on my options page. I just want to go back down to the tab for my keynote. And now the slide comes back up. I can see it as the presenter. You can't see it as the audience yet because I haven't shared it. But now I know I'm back in slide mode. Just hit share at this point, And I'm back into the presentation. I haven't had to backspace. I haven't had to forward space. I'm ready to go through all my slides. Now, again, it's like speaking. It's like creating a new story and sharing it. This is a little awkward at first. It takes some getting used to the... Uh, kind of the sequence of the buttons you hit. I promise you, you'll make mistakes. That's the way to learn. Watch this a few times, it'll help. It's, it sounds more complicated than it is, I promise. Just with a few repetitions, you'll get good at it and you'll have a much smoother presentation the next time you share your slide deck. Try this, look forward to hearing about your success and I'll see you in tip number 35.